Yo guys, what is up? This is Tom from Unreal Meta and in this video I'm gonna show you how to make a low resolution post-processing material in Unreal Engine. So let's start. First you want to create a new material and let's call this PP for post-processing and then just low resolution and let's go into that. And the first thing you need to do is go to the result node, then material domain and click on post process. Then you get this emissive color input. And from here you want to right click and search for scene texture and grab this. And here select post process input zero and the color goes into the emissive color and then we start by grabbing a screen position. And now we need the viewport UV because we want to apply this everywhere. And let's grab a multiply node. From there, we need a floor node. This goes into the B of the multiply. Then we need an append node the append vector this goes into the floor and now you can press one on your keyboard left click you get this note now you can right click and convert to parameter and let's call this height so these are the pixels for the height and now copy and paste this and let's rename this to width and this goes into the b so from here you can select the pixels let's say 256 by 256 is a nice resolution. And now from the multiply node, we go out with another floor node and now a divide node. And now this floor node is divided by this whole setup and this goes into the UVs. You can already see the effect going on here. Let's save this. And all we have to do now is go to visual effects. Let's grab a post process volume. This looks like this, it's just a little cube. Now let's search for render and under rendering features, there's this post process material. And here you have to add an element, then choose asset reference and you can get your post process material. And now you can see if we go inside this cube, it's already pixelated, but if you go outside of this cube, you see it doesn't happen anymore. So we can search for unbound and then just select this as true. And now you can see this is applied everywhere. Of course, you can grab a material instance and you can apply this. And what you can do easily is just change the height and width. So you can make it like 128 by 128 pixels. Save this. And you can see it's even more low res. But I think 256 by 256 is just fine. And this looks a bit better. The last step is you can add film grain too. So let's go to our post process volume, search for film, film grain, and you can add a little bit of that and you get this old like PS1 look. And yeah, this is actually it. I hope you liked this video. If yes, leave a thumbs up. If no, leave a thumbs down. I'll see you next time and bye.